Hi, how to extract information from PDFs. In this example, I just want to extract the total amount on each page. And you can extract any information you want with PDF Data Extractor. In this example, I'm going to show you how to extract just the totals. So in these invoices, they're in a fixed place, the total on each page. I just want to extract that to an Excel file. And then I can total it up in Excel. I'm going to show you how to do this right from scratch. First of all, you need to download PDF Data Extractor. And open when done. So that's now installing. You click next. You can run it now if you want to. So that's now installed and running. Close that down. Now, I've got my uh, PDF here. So what I'm going to do is drag and drop it in the top box there then click analyze this will show each word position so in this example I want to, on the first page I've got a 999 but I've also got 999s there as well which I don't want I just want this one here so to find that one I'm going to go down I can see a 999 there but I can see another two here so the position on this particular PDF is the furthest one on the right hand side of the PDF so the positions horizontal and vertical the zero position is the left bottom of the page so I want the one furthest across so I want the highest number in there so it's this 536 so the ones are less than that now I want to right mouse on that 999 so that's output in this example I'm going to select any H greater than and V exact match so that's vertical exact match so vertical 535 position the horizontal from 536 onwards okay and then I'm going to click process so it will go through each page and extract the information that I want. So I've got nine lines output. In the PDF, I've got nine pages. So that's good news. So I'm going to open output. So open Excel. I can see the numbers there. Now, I've got the file name first, column, and then I've got total number of pages, and then I've got the amounts. I can remove this information if I want to. I can also add other information so go to setup extra fields I don't want the total page count I don't want the output file name I'm just going to do a match page number save and exit the process again click open output and there you go I've got the page number there and the amounts which are in the PDF file. So it's 999 and then 1999, for example. So that's those there. Now that's a quick guide on how to do that. Obviously, you can use it to extract other information. So, say if I want the invoice number as well, I can do the same on that. I can just do right mouse, output. It should be in the same position on every page. I'm just going to do the same match. So now I'm going to close that down, click process, so it should have invoice number and then the amount. So I've got invoice 1 and I guess that on the second page it's invoice 1 as well. So yeah, I've got invoice 1 and then invoice 1 again and then invoice 1 again and invoice 2. So you can see I've got three ones invoices and two um, the reason why it doesn't have leading zeros is because uh, in Excel it ticks those off because it's a number now if I want to set the headers I can do that as well so I can put in page number and then I can do invoice number and then total amount for example process got nine lines output again 
So you can see now in the Excel file, I've got all the information I want there. Now I can go into File Menu, Save Setup, so I can load it again later. So I can now go into File, Load Setup. I can also just drag and drop other files if I want to. It's also a batch option, so if you've got lots of files, with the same type of invoices, you can just drag and drop loads in there and process them all at once, all to one report if you want to as well. And that's it. Give it a try.